a long time no record okay I, i'm sorry it's just it's just that like reels and tiktok has had me in this chokehold and like it's just been like really hard to balance making long horizontal you know videos uh for youtube and just editing and having the time to do that so i've just been over there on ig reels and tiktok uh creating content so if you are not following me there go ahead and follow but i am trying to commit get back into the flow of recording content for y'all because I love it here, you know, regardless of what's coming out on Instagram and TikTok and all the other stuff. I love YouTube. I love conversation. I love getting to talk with y'all. I love getting to share my life here in like depth, you know, like you can't learn a lot from me or my life or really get the big picture of what I'm trying to say in 15 seconds or 30 seconds, like no shade to the other platforms. But I do feel like something is still very unique about YouTube in that, you know, you can have a moment in your day to sit and watch, you know, your favorite YouTubers or just listen to people who have similar experiences than you, you know, in depth. So love it here on YouTube. I'm here to stay. I just need to get back on it and be consistent. So, uh, yeah, hold me accountable, please. And thank you because yeah, I need to be, I need to be accountable to somebody. Okay. But anyways, um, I'm going to be doing a life update today. If you didn't get the, you know, hint with the title and the thumbnail, um, I'm giving you guys a life update because the last time we, we met, Okay, I'm missing like two nails. It's fine. It's totally fine. <laughs> the last time we met, we were about to buy a new house. And y'all, let me tell you, things just like went, you know, pretty quickly, which is a huge blessing um, from there. And we basically are in our new home. Um, here are some photos that we took. Uh, it was quite a quick turnaround process. I did end up having to have a major surgery at the end of uh, December. So that was also keeping me out from creating content and making videos for you all. So there are reasons why I have been out. It hasn't just been like, oh, I'm just sitting on my butt doing nothing, you know? So I did have a major surgery and it went well. I'm okay, I'm healthy. Um, and um, I'm, I recovered very well from the surgery. It was um, due to a health issue that I had to get the surgery done. Um, but I am back and I am better. Someone had asked like, Crystal, are you pregnant? Is that why you're not making videos anymore? Or is that why you're not on like, you know, showing your face or your, you know, yourself? And I was like, girl, no, I am not pregnant. I am just living la vida loca. Okay, I'm living my life. <laughs> and uh, just, you know, I'm not letting life rush me. I think that's really what the big picture is. I'm not letting life rush me. I am seeking God more heavily in this season and listening for him and um, really just this whole big transition that we are currently in, like you have to be really discerning when it comes to big transitions in your life. Who is going into that transition with you? Who is getting left behind that transition? Or who is leaving in, from that transition? You know what I mean? Like who is welcome into your life at your new destination like there are so many things you have to figure out you know because you're in a new space you're in a new area you're around new people and it's so important that you be discerning because that's where that wisdom comes in to not put yourself in positions that you wouldn't have wanted to be in so it's a very sensitive season right now you know um we're furnishing the home um and i actually have a bunch of reels on that on instagram so if you have not um, followed me there or seen them, please go follow me there and catch up over there because I did post a lot of stuff about reels and other stuff. Sorry about that, my camera died, but I'm back. Um, but any who's, but any who's, yeah, that works too. Um, but any who, um, I say all this to say that we've just been in a major transition in life right now and um, it's hard to find like, you know, a pattern or, um, you know, a system, like we're learning a new system, we're learning a new pattern of living, an area that we're living in and all other types of stuff. So it's been really different. Um, but for the most part, I'm still trying to get the home in order. This is like my temporary like backup 
you know set up I don't know what's going on but we just gonna roll with it for now um, but yeah I will say that that's been the most major um, update for me had a major surgery um, in December um, of last year 2021 got discharged literally Christmas Day um, but you know grateful that it went well and that I'm alive and I'm healthy and I'm here so um, can't be bad at that um, we moved into our new home uh, we just had our housewarming um, party, which was really nice. Uh, just getting to see friends and just, you know, celebrate the new home and the blessing with them. So I actually haven't shared this with y'all on YouTube, but I took my clinical exam and I passed. Um, that's pretty major because um, this basically gives me um, the ability to go into private practice and be my own boss and just kind of see patients and clients on my own. And this is just really, really um, a, a place that I have been working to get to for years, you know. Um, it does require a lot of hours of therapy, direct practice, supervision. It was a really big exam at the end of the two years and 3,000 hours. So I'm really glad that I passed it, y'all, because yeah, it's intense. <laughs> So, um, praise God for that. Um, what other updates do we have? We turned the home we moved out of into an Airbnb. So right now we do have people in that are our guests. Um, so that's been really different for me, um, having to learn um, this new system of, you know, um, communicating with our guests and just making them feel welcome and seen and known and just like getting the house ready for it was stressful like it was a lot but I'm glad that at the end it all turned out well um and yeah I can't be mad at that um we have found a church we are very very glad to have found a church because y'all don't know this but ever since 2020 when all the like racial stuff came out and like just the way churches responded and didn't respond like it just really put me in a place where i just you know wasn't really sure what people were on you know like i was just kind of a little a little bit more like aware and like just you know wary of how people you know viewed me as a woman of color and just different things like that so we we well, I'll have to speak for myself i actually hadn't gone to ch like a physical church in almost a year or two like it had been a minute i had watched either online maybe gone to church with like family to their church um but not like on my own like yeah we're consistently going to church like we tried out some churches but they just weren't they weren't giving what they were supposed to get from okay? um or either or i would like it my husband wouldn't type of ordeal so we are so glad that finally we have made it to dallas or the dfw area and we have found our church home so i'm currently serving at our church home because literally y'all prior to finding our church home i feel like god gave me a heart to want to serve like i literally told my husband like i just want to serve at the church i just want to serve at somebody's church <laughs> and um i'm so glad because um i'm able to serve at this church and i'm in the process of just getting to learn people and just getting to meet new people and just like build community which i am a huge advocate for and which i haven't had a lot of in the past couple of years to months you know so i'm really 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 excited about that um i truly am because yeah i'm a people person um if you've met me in person or if you know me personally or if you just see me on youtube you probably can tell like she likes people like she's extroverted Hopefully you can tell, I don't know if you can. But um, anyways, that's just kind of a tidbit of where I am right now. I would say that I am kind of trying to go more into full-time influencing. Um, so when you have an opportunity, support your girl, okay? Because influencing isn't easy. Like it requires so much physical energy, so much mental energy, planning, you know, coordinating and just different things like that. So I'm really excited to be going into it because I really do feel like God has called me into influencing or becoming an influencer or content creator. I feel like I've been doing this since college. Like if you're an OG from Crystal's Diary, you know what it do, baby. You know, you know I'm about this life. You know I'm true to this. You know I'm about this. I've literally been creating content and been influencing for like, since like 20 what? Yeah, I'm gonna put it right here because I need to do the math. But I've been doing influencing for a hot minute 
and I feel like right now it's now a popular thing and which is great but I just love to share my life and inspire people so that's what I'm gonna keep doing um, and I also do want to do you know therapy part-time um, I want to start doing more public speaking so if you have an event invite your girl out I will leave the speaking um, form in my description I will leave it in my description bar if you ever think of an event that you want me to come speak at or if you just want to refer me to somebody that's fine too but uh, I definitely want to get back into speaking because I do feel like God has given me a voice like I really feel like he didn't make me this chatty for no reason okay he didn't make me like this for no purpose so I definitely want to get more into speaking and this is probably like the bigger update like you know that I haven't even really announced on Instagram and I'll probably you know I'll just give you guys more information about it here but um, nothing you know too too obvious um, my husband and I are actually doing and starting something together so we just finished creating like the room in the house and things like that so I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna leave y'all with that hint <laughs> um, and we're really excited I know a lot of people over the years have said like you guys need to do something together or you guys need to you know partner or you know speak together whatever right we're finally doing it we are mm -hmm. and I'm really excited about it because I feel like we're just so you know we have such great perspectives and they're not always the same okay you don't have to marry someone who literally is you you can marry someone different and have good dialogue and communication and you know conversation so um, I'm excited um, I'm excited yeah we're gonna definitely I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop talking because I don't expose exactly what we're doing but Anywho, um, I'm excited to be back. Um, I hopefully will be posting small snippets and updates of the home um, after this video. I just feel like it was only right for me to do this update first and then start posting again because it's like I've been gone for so long. There's so much that has happened, you know? It's only right that I fill you guys in and then start posting again. Um, so yeah. <laughs> I'm back um, my goal is to post once a week so um, I will be posting another video coming up about my LCSW process and just kind of celebrating that in a video and then I also will share more about the process if you are a you know aspiring therapist or social worker or want to become an LCSW I will talk more about the steps on how to do that I've been making some home content, so stay tuned for that as well. Um, that will be going up, um, you know, within the next couple of weeks as well, because like I said, I'm going to make sure that I'm consistent. Like my goal is literally once a week, so let's see how that goes. Uh, make sure y'all are encouraging me because it's not easy, but you know, just, you know, comment if you see me out here posting every week <laughs> consistently, uh, it's a big deal. It was great chatting with y'all. Um, comment below if you, you know, have any updates about yourself from December to now. If there's anything you want to share, feel free to do that and I will chat with you guys later. But first, if you are not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, uh, like this video, all the good stuff turn the bell on so you get notified even though YouTube doesn't even notify people anymore I don't know what's going on but um, yeah we'll talk in my next video and see you soon